good speed and has won two of its three starts this track and distance. Blow Valhalla also uh, solid support. Here we go. Racing now, Zipping Coda came out very well down on the inside in company with Sir Rickson. Now looking for the favourites out wider. Here's Ruby Herrera driving up on the outside as they negotiate the, into the back. Now your leader is Zipping Coda over zip, zip, uh, second placing Ruby Herrera. Blow Valhalla is holding down third position from Diver's old mates. Well back the field is Hunter's Charm and Sir Rickson is a conspicuous last. The leader going well, Zipping Coda. One danger that is Ruby Herrera now starting to pick it up in front though zipping coda right along the inside blow valhalla over the top of them blow how valhalla has got up and beaten either ruby herrera or zipping coda a break to divers old mates at any old price for the first poor takers then hunter's charm never spotted it and sir rickson was well back race number seven well three blow valhalla is the greyhound that was running over the top of them, got the inside run and charged through, has defeated Ruby Herrera and the one zipping coda. It should be 3.61 and 4 in an overall time of 34.95. The early split of 9.37, 22.10. Uh, second split with the run home time shortly available with that winning greyhound blow, Valhalla. Uh, Emmanuel Bors from Windella is your uh, trainer. For the Viking Syndicate, it's a Black Dog El Grand Senor Blow the Doe. It was proven too strong over the concluding part, defeating Ruby Herrera, a Black Bitch Banjo Boy, Tippy for me for Carol Eaton and third to number one. Zipping Coda, who set the pace, a Black Bitch by My Bro, My Bro Fabio, Zipping Catra for Chris Van Vachel and Stephen Francis. So it's 3.61.